now, a nightmare from the deep washes up on a Vietnamese beach. Oh, God. What the cheese is this? This looks like something straight out of a science fiction film. The fishermen have seen every kind of sea life, but absolutely nothing like this. It's a monster out of a horror movie, except this alien creature is 100% real. It seems to have layers of branching tentacles that are folding in and out on itself. They are pretty brave just to be reaching out and touching that. I hope they know what they're dealing with. This thing has countless tentacles, which themselves have tentacles. They appear to writhe independently, reaching out to devour or grasp anything they can. What's worrying is this may be an infant not yet fully grown. What if there's something out there that's much larger than this? You can see how it kind of squiggles around when someone tries to touch it. It looks like it could probably strangle someone if it's big enough and strong enough. July 2018, Vietnam, 150 miles from Ho Chi Minh City. Locals are returning from fishing on the Mekong Delta when they encounter the most extraordinary creature. I've never seen an organism like this. The experienced fishermen that find it have never seen anything like it before. <laughs> Zoologist Roland Kay studies the footage. It looks almost like seaweed, but this is surely no plant. This is an animal or multiple animals, or else it is some corrupted, mutated life form. The tendrils can be outstretched for quite long distances. But this creature is almost certainly not a one-off mutant. Biologist Dustin Growick examines the video. There is good reason this creature looks alien. It appears like it could be a sea star, but it doesn't look like any sea star you'd expect to see. Normally found in the planet's deepest oceans, the creepy-looking marine invertebrate is a distant relative of the sea star. But these creatures of the abyss are rarely seen by humans. Those who have call it the Gorgon's Head because of their likeness to the mythical Gorgon Medusa. It can grow up to three feet long, has no blood, no eyes, and grows back severed limbs, which it uses to drag victims towards its five-jawed mouth Great, yet another nightmare to distract me when I'm trying to sleep. What if there's something out there that's much larger than this? You can see how it kind of squiggles around when someone tries to touch it. It looks like it could probably strangle someone if it's big enough and strong enough. Now, 